Welcome to the Power of VoicePads Home Connect mobile technology. This stunning three bedroom, two full bath, French Norman home is located in Springhurst. The list price on this property has recently been reduced to $495,000. Interior features of this property include hardwood floors, two fireplaces, a formal dining room, granite countertops, and a luxury master suite. Upon completion of your account, our customer care department should have supplied you with a username and password to access your VoicePad dashboard. If you have misplaced it or happen to forget, just simply agents click here and the system will email you that information. Now we're looking at our VoicePad account dashboard. First, let's take a look at your features here in the upper right hand corner. If you should ever forget or not sure what your access number is, it's always listed in the right hand corner of your VoicePad dashboard. We also have a Get Support tab, which allows you to email our customer care department directly with any support that you may need. And then also a quick stats report. This is a quick overview of the last five months on the leads that are generated on your listings. Let's move forward and take a look at my profile. This is your information, your preferences on how you want the system set up. Your name, company, and address is included. Let's take a look at your phone features. The top telephone number here is the telephone number that a caller will be transferred to. So if they press one to speak to you, we will direct them to this telephone number. Make sure that this is the correct number you want your caller transferred to. Next is the text messaging feature. You will have to activate this. It's not automatically done for you. In addition to the email notification, that comes automatically, a text message can also be sent to you. The text message comes very quickly within 30 seconds once a consumer enters the code. You set this up by entering your five digit mobile number and select your wireless carrier. Once you have done that, just simply send a test text message to your phone to make sure you have it set up. Also, make sure you have new voicemail notification turned on and inquiry notification turned on as well. Next, we're going to talk about the feature here on the right hand side of your screen, which is call announcement. You simply click here and what call announcement does, it allows you to transfer the caller to a different telephone number between a particular time. You can also set your system on do not disturb if you're in a closing and you can't take any phone calls. But with call announcement turned on, Eve acts like a personal assistant and she handles your telephone calls for you. For example, the consumer calls in, listens to a presentation, and presses one to transfer. The system will automatically put that caller on hold with hold music and then call you directly. You answer and you will hear Eve. She will say, you have a caller holding for information on your property at 123 Main Street. Press one now to be connected or press two to send them to voicemail. If you're in a closing or showing property and you're not able to take that call, you can definitely send that caller directly to the voicemail option, which is saved on your VoicePad account dashboard. What this does, it gives you some information before you get connected to the consumer. One, you know that this caller has come through the voice pad system, and two, you know exactly what listing they want information about before you get connected. If you turn off call announcement, then the caller is sent to your cell phone directly without any help from E.
If you have an assistant or a team member that you also want them to be copied on the leads, you can add an additional email by separating the two with a semicolon. And that person will also be included when a lead is generated and email will be sent to them. If you only want to receive a text notification and not an email, you can simply deactivate this by selecting No. To the right of your screen is a call detail summary report. You can choose how often this is emailed to you. This will show you listing agents, the leads that are being generated off of your listings, with, whether it's on a weekly time frame or a daily or never. Change password. If you want to change your password to something that you're more familiar with, you can definitely do so. It has to be all numeric characters, four to six digits. And next is record name. When logging into your VoicePad dashboard the first time, the system will prompt you to do a series of setup functions. The system will ask you to record your name and broker affiliation. This allows you to get branding onto your system, which will sound something like this. This property is represented by, and it will go into your voice, Sarah Thompson from Town & Country Realty. It's done very, very easy by clicking the Record Now button. Eve will call you on the telephone number that's indicated above, and you record this information directly through the telephone. Let's return back to the account dashboard. Next, let's take a look at your lead manager. This report shows all the leads that have been generated through your VoicePad system, the date and time that the call was made. It gives you the option to schedule a follow-up. The property address, the agent name, this is the caller ID and the caller name. Something else I want to show you is new voicemail. This indicates that this caller left a voicemail on this particular lead. You can access it through your lead manager report or also hear it directly through the dashboard. Your next options are uploading your leads into Top Producer. We are integrated with that software. You can print and export your leads into an Excel sheet for your records. This allows you to choose a particular listing or a particular date uh, um, and time frame that you want to see um, the leads generated. Next, let's take a look at the marketing toolkit. This is where you'll find the ability to order voice pad signs and sign writers and standalones. Listing tools. This is information that just to help you how to win a listing, um, print listing collateral. This is uh, documentation that you can leave in the listing packet after you've done your listing presentation. Or you can email the collateral directly to the seller. Let's go in now and set up a property presentation. You should have available codes on your dashboard. And you're very easy going to click to set up. You're going to choose the different type of real estate that it is, whether it's multifamily, commercial. Today we're going to select residential. Then your next option is to choose whether to record the presentation in your own voice or allow Eve to announce the property. We do recommend that you do select Eve. By doing this, the presentation is automatically set for English and Spanish. But you very easily will come in and put in the bedrooms, the bathrooms, property description, maybe it's charming, square footage of the property, your MLS ID number, general area, and then the address. Once you've completed that, hit Next. Next, we're looking at interior features. Everything you check will be announced on the presentation. 
So today we're going to say that this property has a gourmet kitchen, a first floor master, his and her closets, and an open floor plan. If you'll scroll down, we've also included additional features here, where if it has a walkout finished basement, partly finished, full basement, kitchen appliances, recent renovations, and flooring. Next is the exterior features of the property, whether there's a private pond, a deck, fencing, a beautiful view, you can definitely add that on. Next is community amenities. Maybe there's an actor, active um, homeowners association um, within this neighborhood or close by public parks. Next is the pricing page. You will need to add this in whole dollars. And out of the five pages of features that we provide, we also give you the option to add additional comments. You can use our text-to-speech computer. You will type in your description and a computerized uh, text-to-speech option will translate what you've typed. It will not be announced in Eve's professional recorded voice. With that being said, we do recommend that you record any additional comments in your own voice. It's very easy to do. Eve calls you. When you're ready and you have your script, simply hit the record now button. Eve will call you on this telephone number provided above and you simply just record it through your telephone. Once we've completed that, we're gonna save and return to account dashboard. Now let's take a quick listen to what our presentation sounds this like. This property is a charming four bedroom, three full baths condominium. This property is listed for $247,000. Interior features of this property include a first floor master, an open floor plan, a gourmet kitchen, and his and her closet. This property is represented by Sarah Thompson, Keller Williams Realty. All right, we've got our presentation finished and completed and we're ready to move forward. If you have an open house scheduled for one of your listings, you can definitely add that onto the VoicePad system by selecting the, the date and the time that you're gonna hold your open house. Just note that the open house dates will not be announced by Eve until we're within six days of the open house. Once the open house has passed, that information automatically removes itself off of the dashboard. Once you have an open house scheduled, the house icon will be included here to let you know that you've set that information up. Available date. This is a feature that you can use for new construction. Um, or if you have a home that the seller's not ready to show, um, or you have a home that's immediate occupancy, you can include an availability date onto the presentation. Unplayed messages. This is where you can access your voicemails that are saved by clicking here. And it takes you to the voicemail and you can play it directly through your computer. You may need to update the most recent Windows Media Player onto your computer. If you're having issues and the voicemail does not play, first try downloading the latest version of Windows Media Player onto your computer. But we house all of your voicemails here. If you have not listened to the voicemail yet, this will continue to flash. Once you've listened to it, it will just be one color. Edit price, edit voice, or just quick tabs. Let's say you've got a price reduction on Marble Creek and you need to come in and reduce it. You simply come to the pricing page, update the price, save changes in return, and the new price has been updated instantly. 
The trend and detail report. These two reports are very, very handy, particularly with your sellers. When you want to share with them the leads that are being generated, you can download this report per month. Let me pull it up and bring it in a little closer so we can see. This is on an individual listing. This particular listing so far has received eight leads in September with one of them transferring directly to the listing agent. The green bar indicates that the caller just called in and listened to the property features. The gray bar indicates that the consumer pressed one to transfer to you. This very easily can be emailed, saved and printed, and shared with your seller. The detail report is a lot like the trend, however there's more detail on this report. And let me pull it up a little closer so we can look at it. I wouldn't recommend sending this report to your seller because it does include the caller ID name and telephone number. However, another tool that's very important on this report is called duration. We track how long the consumer stays on the phone call and how long they listen to the presentation. Alrighty, those are the functions of the dashboard. Let's say the Stone Mountain Road has sold and you want to remove it off of your dashboard. You're going to click to edit a presentation and it gives you the option to reuse a code. Are you sure you want to delete this presentation? Yes, delete current presentation. Would you like to set up a new property for code 107? I'm going to say no. Thank you for joining me today. If you should have any questions, please feel free to contact us at area code 502-515-7400 and ask for the customer care department. Or simply email us at customer.care at voicepad.com.